Hello, my lovelies. So, as you can tell, my hair is quite long. Let's just show you how long it is, shall we? Alright, normal. Going, 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 and it's finally over. I have <clears throat> what my friends and I call white girl weave. What is a white girl weave, might you ask? It's a weave for white girls. It's pretty self-explanatory, I know. None of this is mine except for, like, this small section. I did a fashion show yesterday, Red Ball fashion show, raising money, a fundraiser for AIDS. And it was the funnest show I've ever done. I guess every time I do a fashion show now, they just get better and better. Because I feel like I've been saying that every time I do a fashion show. Who did my hair was Matthew Morris. Um, he's done hair for New York Fashion Week and he did it for the last Victoria's Secret show. So I was very lucky and very privileged to get to work with him. You can't really even tell that this is a weave probably until I turn around. See this lump right here? So what they did is they cornered my hair. All cornrows, like I said, except for this little strip. And the reason I left this little strip is because otherwise you'd be able to see the line of the extensions. Yeah, this was difficult to sleep in. It really hurt because there's this big lump. So what it is, it's cornrows and obviously my hair, you know, is like this long. So there was some tails. So they bunched them up and put them in a ball right here, and that's why there's a big lump right here. I slept with it braided because apparently once it's a big mess, it's like impossible to undo. When I took my shower, I'll show you guys what I did right now. So this is me getting ready to take a shower. I had to get my weave out of the way of the water because it was all plastic extensions. So couldn't get that all nappy and wet. So yeah, I used a Target plastic bag, very high fashion and expensive. I know, yeah, I just couldn't afford a shower cap, so yeah, rawr. And then right here, I am taking out the braid that I had the weave in. It's a pain in the ass to brush, because first of all, it's not real hair. It was getting all over the place, it was shedding, hurt, kind of, and yeah, but it looked cool, and I really liked it a lot. And yeah, so that was my adventure of taking a shower. And some of it got wet, as you can see right here. Wait, is that my hair? <laughs> Maybe my real hair. Oh, it is! That's why it's all disgusting looking. Because it's my real hair. And I feel like Rihanna right now. My sister was trying to help me take the back part out because it hurt so bad. It's in a lump. A big clump and it hurt really bad and it was really tight and full of bobby pins now it looks kind of weird I really wish I could keep these forever but I can't because it hurts my hair is probably really dirty because I hadn't washed it in like three days before the show because I knew they'd ruin it and I'm shedding Wow. Next project for Amy, grow out your hair. But no more of you guys nagging me to cut it short because it makes me want to do it. But. Now I have to write two papers that are, one of them are five pages long and one of them are eight pages long. Yes! So excited. <sighs> Took out my extensions and I look creepy now. Okay, you wanna know what the result is? This, and then, 
This was in my hair. My mom helped me take it out. But like I said before, they left this part unbraided, so it covered all of it, so it looked a little normal. I think I'll show you what it'll look like. When they were doing my hair yesterday, they were like, oh my god, she looks like Bo Derek. And then a lot of people say I look like Bow Wow. It's like Bow Wow or Bow Wow Wow. Where she sings, I want candy. Side view. Woo. Woo. Yeah. Blue.